seven six in the third against Vika Zarenka. Elena, nice to see you again at our Thank Tennis you. Channel Cadillac desk. I, I I must say, you 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 don't look like you've played a three hour match. You look fairly fresh. Yeah, I'm well, let's see in an hour. I doubt <laughs> I'm gonna be smiling, guys. <laughs> well, at least you're smiling now. That was a phenomenal third set breaker. But before we get there, that second set, it looked like Vika was running away. You seemed low in energy. How did you find the energy in the third set? Yeah, it was really tough uh, in the second set. I mean, the first one was also kind of on the limit for me, and uh, I really served well, so I could close it out. But then in the second, also this pause when she went to the toilet, and uh, uh, I think I waited a bit longer, and then she started really aggressive. And after first three games, which I lost very quick, I knew that to come back is going to be very difficult. So I was kind of mentally preparing for the third set. When you got to the third set, was there was there any physical uh, ailments? Did you did you need more liquids or any any food or or physically you felt fine? No, I think just the humidity and the conditions here are really tough. And physically, I'm not at my best. So of course, it was really difficult for me just to stay out here. It's it's not easy and to play neither. So uh, I just took some break. Uh, I changed and uh, I was uh, just fighting for every point. I knew it's going to be a battle. She's not, not going to give up, uh, me neither. So uh, we ended up 7-6 in the third. Well, you've, you've been through a lot over the last two weeks. So the way you fought today was just incredible. But when you served for the match and you lost that, and then Vika was up 6-5, you still seemed so calm. And that was such a fantastic tie break you played. What were you telling yourself after you, after you lost serve? Well, uh, every every match here was uh, really tough for me. And uh, with Maria, I had the same situation, early break. And then uh, I was soaring with the new balls and I took my chances. But here with Vika, I knew that uh, sometimes it doesn't go second time your way. And uh, uh, also, she was returning pretty well. She was reading the surf, uh, so it was not easy. But then, uh, of course, after that game, which I lost, I knew that I need just to keep on fighting. And on the tie break, I. I just decided to went for it no matter what and uh, surf uh, out of a sudden uh, the percentage went out, <laughs> went up and uh, it really went my way and uh, I was just going for it till the end. You went for it and you executed beautifully. A lot of players say when you're playing well, it's easy for, for the wins and everything to come. But when things are difficult, that's when the real champions come to play. So you've won four three set matches here. In a way, is that more satisfying for you than, than maybe sometimes the easy matches? Well, honestly, I don't know. I I didn't come with a lot of ex expectation this tournament. And uh, for now, it was such a marathon. So I don't even remember the tournament. I physically was that difficult for me. And uh, honestly, I don't know how I'm surviving this uh, this tournament. But I'm pretty happy with, uh, with the fighting spirit which I have here. And... Uh, it's going my way sometimes like also get, should be on your side and the, this week I think uh, it's going my way so I'm, I, I will try to keep on going till the end. Well you're, you're right there now there's only one more match to play you'll have a day off with all of the physical uh, uh, challenges that you've had to go through will you will you just take the day off completely tomorrow or, or maybe hit some balls? Well uh, uh, honestly without uh, any secrets every match I played here next day I didn't practice so yeah it's also first time for me uh, we, we made this decision and uh, we see how I'm gonna feel tomorrow but uh, I'm not sure if I'm coming on site <laughs> well listen listen it's worked for you not yeah. playing on your days off so maybe you maybe you stick to it it'll be Danielle Collins or Alexandrova you have a winning record against Collins and a losing record against Alexandrova but um, you're playing fantastic tennis so do you do you have a preference Who you play honestly no preference uh, my only thoughts now is just to survive to try to recover and of course uh, they both playing very aggressive they play really well this tournament uh, i think they're a little bit more uh, fresher physically so i mean my goal is just uh, to try to recover to stay aggressive uh, with my game and uh, focus on the surf of, of course get some rest get a beautiful meal tonight you earned it and best of luck in the final thank you